guys, I wanted to tell you a story time. This is about my imaginary friend, Dina. Well, I was about four or five. I had this imaginary friend. Her name is Dina. Okay, this is like super crazy. I still think about this all the time. I have dreams about her. And like, out of all places, if I still believed in her, she'd probably be, probably be right there, standing right behind me. But I don't really believe in her no more, so. Okay, so I just want to make this pretty quick. Um, so when I was like about four or five, I had this imaginary friend, Dina. She told me something that happened two years later. So she told me that I would get a best friend. And then in third grade, that best friend, we would be separated into different classes. And a kid that I met the year before would become my then best friend that I'd be very close to. That happened. Um, the first one, her name is Chloe. I met her in first grade. And she was so nice. I loved her. And in second grade, we sat right next to each other. Um, but eventually we got moved. In second grade, I met this girl. Her name was Kaylin. She's my current best friend. Um, I really love her. I, I feel comfortable telling her everything. Um, I feel comfortable with telling her about this story. I don't know why. I'm going to tell her after this. So. It happened. So, in she came in the middle of the year. She became a friend. We, the next year, in third grade, me and Chloe, we were separated into two different classes, just like Dina said. And just like Dina said again, Kayla became my best friend forever. Closer friend than Chloe was to me. And Chloe is very close. Me and Chloe, we, we, okay. We literally were very close. We lived close to each other. We were always close to each other in class. Now it's different because we don't even talk at recess anymore. First of all, because we barely have recess. And then second of all, because she has other friends that she plays with. And I play with Kaylin and Jada, which is another friend I have. Who's who I met because of Kaylin. Um, so yeah, that was the story about my imaginary friend Dina, who can tell the future. Maybe she was real. Maybe she was a ghost or something. I have no idea. But it was weird. It was crazy. I was like five, four or five. So to me, like, I'm like, I believed it. And now I don't really believe in her that much anymore. But if I did, I would believe in everything she said. I do sometimes see her. Like, not like creepily in the corner of my room, but. I just see her, like, walking behind me. It's, I know it's just my imagination, but it's kind of weird. All right, that's all for this video. Bye!